I see you've all decided to join me. Oh, what's this, my shirt? No context. <laughs> Hello, Delta and Alex and Mariah and Wyatt Seek, which that is a fantastic username, Mariah. I agree. Whenever I see it, I'm like, Seek. Seek. How is everybody doing? Happy Monday. You best girl. Thank you, Delta. I did see the redemption. Don't worry. Don't worry. I got, I can get your card. Thank you, Delta. My bangs are quite, uh, you know, doing their own thing today. We have the curls out and my, my new shirt that I'm very excited about. It's so weird. I found it while thrifting. Like, what does this mean? Probably means you made 4,000 jobs. I didn't. But now I own this shirt. I put 4,000 people in the field. <laughs> How is everybody's weekend, though? I hope everyone is doing well. I'm... Oh. Figured it'd be pretty rumble. Yes, it's very good. It's very good for that. Found a Beatles t-shirt. Thinking it was a Stream Raiders reference. Oh, no, it's not. But that's... That's interesting. No, I found it at, at Value Village. And I was like, this is so weird. I want it. <laughs> Which is how I do most of my Value Village shopping. I'm like, oh, it's so strange. And I live nearby, like, C the Seattle area. So there's a lot of, like, tech companies around. So there's lots of tech shirts. Like, I found old, like, Facebook company shirt and stuff I was tempted to get. But I'm not, I don't want to advertise, you know? Hi, Meg. Hello. How are you doing? How is it going? What did it cost, though? This was $2. $2 for I put 4,000 people in the field, which I I think is worth every penny. Every penny. I also got some other fun stuff, but it's a secret for later this week, actually. I'm doing a, a fun, exciting stream on Friday. Wore a handmade shirt that said Mother of the Bride all through high school. I found it good, but I, I love that sort of thing. I love it when you can see a shirt and you're like, this was made for one specific person and they got rid of it and now I own it. $2, yeah, I love a cheap t-shirt. And it's like nice, it's nice and soft. It isn't like super worn or anything. So it, it joins my collection of too many black t-shirts. They're kind of my favorite shirts to wear. I'm excited to go work out in this at the gym. <laughs> it just... <laughs> I put 4,000 people in the field. <laughs> okay, let me let me get your card, Delta. My whole closet's from Goodwill, our second day. I mean, it's like, it's not only uh, a more affordable option in a lot of cases, but you can find really cool stuff a lot of the time. I really enjoy going to Value Village and just like finding what I can, uh, what I can find. And Delta, your card is, <gasps> it's the chariot. You get the horses. Nay. Okay, what does the chariot mean for Delta? Number seven. <laughs> the chariot shows us the constant tug of war between our conscious selves and our id based drives. It encourages development of a healthy ego, that is to say, a sense of who you are and what you want in life, but it definitely wags a finger at ego that trips into arrogance or self righteousness, and it cautions against letting our self consciousness urge or our subconscious urges get the best of us. Like a charioter reining in two horses, we can harness our destinies and ride towards them with ease. As long as we maintain balance and awareness, look out, Spartacus. Okay. So develop a healthy ego and find what you want and who you are in life. <laughs> you know, the basics. 4K into muscles. Exactly, exactly. One day I will be strong. Got a little muscle, but I want to have a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Found plastic Star Wars green and red lightsaber. Oh, that's fun. I used to, God, I used to play with lightsabers so much as a kid, but I wasn't super into Star Wars. I just like liked this hidden people with sticks, you know? <laughs> My grandpa is amazing when it comes to going to secondhand stores on the right days. I know. I want to know like what the, what the good days are to shop, right? But I also work during, because I feel like you have to go during like the daytime to find the cool stuff. But it's like, cool, let it go with the off one. What's everybody's like favorite thrift store find. I have a um, a sweatshirt that I quite like that I tie-dyed. I don't know if it's on. 
I think I moved it. And I have a dress that I really like. I have a couple dresses that I've thrifted that I really like. I found some good, good dresses at the thrift store. Been contemplating that honestly, been more driven to bettering myself. Ah, oh, and passions. Yeah, there's something really nice in life once you start like focusing on your hobbies and finding things you really love to do in life and like taking care of yourself and things like that. I feel like that really drives me as a human and makes me feel really good. Um, which is obviously why I do my hobbies, like my streaming and video stuff. I also have this new pillow, which is, it's a reference to another one of the Nancy Drew games. It's one I haven't streamed, but it's one of my favorite ones. And Muska's a black cat, show up. It's all cute, it's all cute. That gets to hang out in the background. Found a leather trench coat that looked like it belonged to Doctor Who. Oh, that's so fun. That's so fun. After my old roommate went to jail recently, I had to rethink many things. I can imagine. I can imagine. It's like Sailor Moon. It is kind of. It is kind of Sailor Moon vibes. My fave has been an old school avocado green recipe organizer filled with Betty Crocker recipes from the 70s. Oh, that's so cool. Have you tried to make any of them? Have any of them turned out good? That seems so fun. My blanket. <laughs> <laughs> we're struggling today we're struggling i have already had a g fuel today i had a g fuel at like two because i made coffee this morning but i made it really weak weak sauce coffee so i had g fuel at like two o'clock and i've been zooming today zooming three bucks at goodwill the good you got the absolute goods Ugh, i need to go to my value village more often i need to scope it out because like <laughs> My weekend routines usually involve me either going to uh, Half Price Books or to TJ Maxx. So I feel like I need to throw a value village into the rotation. I just like looking at what shows up. I don't even need to buy things. I just like having a little walk around and checking it out. Gosh, no, but there's some weird ones in there. Oh, old recipes are so fun to look at, but like kind of scary. Use a lot of mayonnaise sometimes and you're like, Drive from Texas, just yeah, everybody meet up at Goodwill. So we'll go to San Diego for TwitchCon, but instead of going to TwitchCon, we'll just go to Goodwill. <laughs> we'll, we'll go to one with like the bins and we'll dig around. <laughs> also, Alex, how are you? How has everybody been? I hope you're all doing okay. Just moved to a new city, so I can't wait to check out all of the thrift stores. <gasps> That's so fun always when you go somewhere new and like scope out the vibe. Because some places have like fancy Goodwills. Like some in Seattle are quite expensive. Um, but like where I used to live, the Value Village was like perfect. They had like a ton of secondhand outdoor stuff because so many of the people who lived in the area were like really outdoorsy and like hiking and stuff. So I got like secondhand Eddie Bauer and like nice hiking equipment for such a good price. It was so good. So yeah, it's so fun going somewhere new and being like, what is the vibe of the region? What do we have here? <laughs> Just bought 30 plus Halloween containers. Never got to use them. Ooh. Get some candy and give them out. Fun, Delta. Fun. Hi, Keish. How are you doing? How was your weekend? We're talking about Goodwill finds or like thrift store finds and the best ones and things we found. A lot of gelatin usage. Yes. The jello salads. That was such a big thing. I feel like my grandma's generation, that was such a big thing for them. Anyone else from Texas we can go? Oh, yeah. We're all planning a Goodwill meetup. Uh, <laughs> You have a favorite section? I love, I mean, I like looking if they have any games. I like looking through those because I feel like the games that end up at Goodwill are very interesting. Um, say with books and movies, a little bit, a little bit. And then um, I like the homeware. I like searching through in the electronics. I like seeing what electronics are there, like what weird gadgets, like waffle makers and fancy coffee machines and stuff. And yeah, I don't buy a lot from the gadgets, but I love seeing what's there and board games. I like secondhand board games. Oh my goodness. So many, so many things I like to <laughs> look at. Used to drive and find old thrift stores. Oh, they're not around anymore. No, I need, yeah, I want to like explore more and find more. We gelatin with broccoli. Oh. <laughs> Ahoy, weekend was pretty damn good. Finally managed to paint mountains. Fantastic, fantastic. Oh my goodness. For Shelly, I was in the drummer. I was the drummer for Baking Benjamin. Big if true. No, the only big thing about me is I put 4,000 people in the field for Shelly. I don't know what you're talking about. 
<laughs> but Keish, I'm glad your weekend was so good. I also had a good weekend. Syphy came to visit me and we had, we just had a little, a little fun. I went to the zoo. I had such a good weekend. I went to the zoo. I went out for brunch. I had really good brunch. Um, what else? And then I went, I went to Value Village. We went to Target. Hello, Jules. Hello. Yeah, I had, I had a really good time. Mary breaking our Benjamin, just give me the money. <laughs> if I find a PC game, I would send it to Mary. Mary gets imported. Games are, oh, that'd be so fun. Lemon, hello for streaming. It should be super, I know, I feel like I usually like warn you all in the Discord ahead of time. Like, hi, I'm streaming today, but I forgot to today. Um, this shirt is already an inside joke. It's, I love this shirt. I love it so much. It's so weird. It's the best thrift, best thrift store find. <laughs> and nice surprise, Lemon, how are you doing? How are you feeling? I know you weren't feeling super well. Was it today or yesterday? You weren't feeling super well, but I hope you've ha been having a good day and a good weekend. Same with you, Jules. I hope you're doing well. Um, but yeah, I got to go to the zoo and it was really cool. I got to see a polar bear. Okay, wait, if everybody, if you get to go to the zoo, what's everybody's favorite zoo animal to see? Because I love bears. I love polar bears so much. Um, they're so big and friendly and beautiful. Like literally so beautiful. I love them. Tigers are great also. I was excited for, the, I, well, yes, I, I, wait, lies? What have I lied about? <laughs> Went to therapy and cinema and just did a hair and face mask. That sounds like a lovely day. Did you see Batman? Cause I, I, you were talking about seeing Batman, right? Did you see it? Giraffes and hy hyenas. <laughs> I'm saying that so weirdly. Giraffes are so cool. Oh my goodness. They don't have any at my local zoo or hyenas. Manatees. They're so big. They're such big friends hanging out. <laughs> Found these weird frames. They had movie stars in them. Oh, actual photos from the old days. That'd be fun. How did you, how did you like Batman? Did you enjoy it? Polar bears. Yeah, it's interesting. Like specific zoos have specific animals, which I guess makes sense. The zoo I go to is like regionally focus so only specific animals from a certain area are there i think i think tigers were really memorable the one had an albino oh, that sounds beautiful beautiful oh, tigers are gorgeous they really just are big kitty cats big kitty cats all these specific but i like seeing the peacocks oh, peacocks are so sassy my my zoo also has some free reign peacocks that are quite quite sassy <gasps> bernie i also love the otters also how are you otters are so cute otters and seals but little otters like there was one at the zoo i went to and it was like flipping around in the water trying to eat a snack so cute so cute it was okay a bit fun but long for me ah uh, i get that it's hard for me to sit through a full movie now um even if it's a good movie I'll be like, mm. <laughs> this is a lot to get through. The manatee, my family is here. <laughs> like monkey, the monkeys are always cool to see. It's cool to see how like easily they can move around and stuff. And also they're like social interactions. My zoo also had penguins and puffins. I love the birds. I saw an owl. <gasps> I love owls. <laughs> monkey. <laughs> so a godfather for the first time how was that i haven't ever seen that um but keisha or keisha was sorry i froze for a second um because my computer did a weird thing uh i'm afraid my computer's gonna crash today <laughs> i've had some troubles hi zoomer hi um but bernie how are you that's what i was gonna say <laughs> and then my brain like ooh. I find them fascinating. So, so human right, exactly. It's so it's so wild to see uh, the similarities between like our societies and them and how we exist. Also, Zoomer, hello. I'm not sure if I said hello, but hello. Trying to catch up. Um, I did have a G Fuel like a couple of hours ago, so I'm hoping I'm still still zooming with that. Otherwise, I might get a little tired. I'm afraid. I don't know. I just man, work is hard. It, it sucks to work and then like be sleepy but want to stream and hang out and say hi to all of you all and tell you welcome to the zoo i wish i had my photos ready to share having tummy pain no oh, bernie i'm so sorry that really sucks said hello okay good good everyone gets a hello how are you streamer what wolf game throw like the goal today is to complete 
the curse of Blackmore Manor. So werewolf. I should have clarified. Let's solve this werewolf, not just a wolf. Ironically, I filmed a video earlier today that also had to do with werewolves. So, <laughs> yeah, I get a hot water bottle. Oh, I love a hot water bottle. So good. I also love turtles. Tur okay, wait, let me see if I can show you pictures, but like kind of just show you my phone screen. <gasps> I saw a Tapar. Look at this. Look at this king. Look at this star. Oh my God. He was just snoozing, thriving. I love these ones. I love these. Turtles eating watermelon. Oh, so cute. Yeah, a king snoozing. I saw jellyfish and they were like in this big orb. There's me pondering my orb. That's full of jellyfish. The oh God, that's my face. No. <laughs> I went to the zoo yesterday. Yesterday I went to the zoo. So this is like full of moon jellyfish. So pretty. I love jellyfish. Um, here's a tiger on a rock. Oh no, the tiger's washed out. It's literally this like light blob right here that you can't see. That's the tiger. That's a rock. It's a really good rock, isn't it? It's a really good rock. Hi, duck. You love the zoo. Duck, what is your favorite thing to see at the zoo? What do you like to see? And then I have, of course, my king, the polar bear. I love them. And then also in this photo, I believe, is Syphy's head. <laughs> That's what the main attraction at the zoo is. Penguins, wait, wait, wait. I think I have a picture of the penguins. Man, this is such a janky way for me to show you all this, but... They're the little penguins. Okay, okay. The penguins had all these little stone structures, like little houses. <gasps> Compact hello. <laughs> Welcome in, Alex. They had all these little stone structures. And so one penguin was standing in one. And then a bunch were like laying down in front of that other penguin facing it. So I was like, what is happening in the penguin society here? What is this? You know, like, why are they all laying down towards this one that is standing inside a structure? I felt like some politics were taking place that I couldn't comprehend. Damon! Thank you so much for the resub and joining me for zoo talk. Um, it's very important for me to talk about the zoo. Damon, what's your favorite animal to see at the zoo? Yeah, penguin hierarchies were taking place. I like, I'm so, I wanted to talk to a zookeeper and be like, so what is this, you know? <laughs> Big Damon day night, <laughs> day Monday. <laughs> um, I also saw an octopus. Look at him, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I only, oh no, that was not the right video. Wait, 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 this one's the longer video. Look at him. They're so scary, but they're so cool. I'm like, I'm just like wowed and amazed by octopuses existing. Yeah, the zoo was so fun. I had a really, I just had a really good weekend. It was really busy, but very fun. And next weekend's also going to be really busy, but really fun. I'm so excited. I can't share my secret life with you all, but exciting things are happening. Oh, the first exciting thing I should say is I'm doing a co-stream with Snuggly on Friday. It'll be on her channel. We'll both be there though. You'll be able to see our shining faces. We're gonna be playing Nancy Drew. So I'll, I'll put an alert in the Discord when that happens as well. Um, but yeah, so Friday, instead of streaming here, I, we're gonna be on Snuggly's channel doing a co-stream, playing a Nancy Drew game. It should be fun. <laughs> Actually went to the zoo a couple weeks ago, made friends with an ostrich and a zebu, a cow thing. But I think my favorite things were there were the eider, the eider ducks, eider, is that how you pronounce it? Um, Oh my god, so cool! I love the zoo, and it's nice that so much of it is outside, at least at my zoo, so like, you can like, not be super close to other people. Eider ducks are super handsome! Ooh, they look very like, uh, what's the term? Aerodynamic. Like, they look kind of like, s slick, fashionable, you know? A fashionable duck. Let's make a noise like a sarcastic old lady. Wait. Can I hear it? <laughs> let me, let me. Eider duck sound. Always think they're like a squatting heron. The sarcastic duck. Oh. Oh. 
So I, I had a good time. I went to the zoo with so I'm gonna check over my photos. I feel like my memories are stored in photos. I had a very good breakfast. Look at that breakfast. Potatoes. There's an egg on there. My every my camera really washes me out. It's probably because I'm wearing black. <laughs> Ooh, new follower. Ooh. <laughs> I saw it. there's an owl in this photo. You, you can barely see it. Barely see it. What a shame. Oh, and then I also got some wire racks to hang my- Oh, that's really washed out. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, maybe this one will look better. Some wire racks to hang my headsets from. And that was from Daiso. I went to- I went to Daiso? Oh, my gosh. What an eventful time it was. Do I have anything else I can share from Daiso? I don't think I have anything fun I can show right now. I got secrets. I got secrets for Friday. Friday's gonna be a really fun stream. So I hope uh, if y'all are awake, you can come hang out. And yeah, I think that's up to date for me. I need to go grocery shopping at some point. Somebody else make my grocery shopping list. I, I keep having dreams about bananas. <laughs> this is like such a weird thing. But I keep having dreams where like I have bananas to eat. And then I wake up and I realize I don't have bananas to eat and I'm really sad about it. Milk. I actually have a lot of milk right now because I accidentally bought two containers. <laughs> I bought both oat and almond milk. So I'm set on milk. Unless I want actual milk. Now with vitamin R. Milk matter? Milk matter? Um. I'm so sleepy now. My... The thing has an eyeball on it currently. That's good. Home decor. You know, we're setting the energy. We're setting the vibe. Can I stay awake? <laughs> I'm so snoozy. Um, oh my god, I can't believe Omacat did a collab with Hololive. I forget how big VTubers are. I need to watch more VTubers because I feel like there's such a culture there that I don't fully comprehend. Do we ever get to see how hairy this lady is? Well, we saw her arm, but I think that that's it. I don't know if we get to see the rest of the hair. I think it might just be the arm, which is disappointing. I think we deserve like the full reality of the situation and we're really just not getting it. Sorry, I'm trying to see if my eyes look red. <laughs> okay, should we? I think we should, like, get into the mystery so I don't fall asleep. Because I know we have a lot of puzzles ahead. And I know the last puzzle. Oh, through the fire and flames. Keesh. Okay. I need my actual guitar. I'm wearing a skirt today. Look at this. A skirt. Through the fire and flames. Um, is there like an easy version of Through the Fire and Flames? Can I have like Guitar Hero easy mode? Through the fire and flames chords, you know? It's also been a long time since I've listened to this song. Oh my god. No, it's so hard. B minor A. Uh -huh. It's probably okay if I try. This is F sharp. This is so much thinking. Wait. Oh, I'm. Okay, oh, see. Oh, 
Okay. No, Quiche, you redeemed this. I'm gonna try and play it. <laughs> is that a B minor? <laughs> hey guys, does that sound like a B minor? It's not. That's a B minor. In the cold, in the cold, on a cold winter morning, in the time before the light, in flames of death, eternal rain, we right before the fight. <laughs> when the darkness has fallen down, and the times are all, and the times are tough, all right. The sound of evil laughter falls around the world tonight. Fighting hard, fighting on the steel through the wastelands evermore. The scattered souls will feel the hell bodies wasted on the shores. On the blackest plains in hell's domain, <laughs> we watch them as we go. In fire and pain, and once again we know, know. Okay, <laughs> so now we fly. So now we fly free. We're free before the thunderstorm. I don't remember how the chorus goes. We fly ever free. We're free before the thunderstorm. How does the chorus go? <laughs> Wait, that's not the chorus. That's the pre chorus. Okay. So far away, we wait for the day. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no. So far away, we wait for the day for the light source we wasted in. Gone. We feel the pain of a lifetime is seen a thousand days through the fire and the flames we carry. And do 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 Okay, I'll do another verse. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> As the red day is dawning and the lightning cracks the sky, they'll raise their hands to the heavens above with resentment in their eyes. Running back to the mid-morning light that's burning in my heart. We've banished from a time in a falling land to a land beyond the scars. In your darkest dreams, see to believe. Our destiny is time, and endlessly we'll all be free tonight. And on the wings of a dream, so far beyond reality, all alone in desperation, now the time has gone. Lost inside, you'll never find, lost without my own mind. <laughs> day after day, this misery must go on. So far away, we wait for the day. <laughs> and the lights, light source go wasted forever. <laughs> wait, I'm skipping lights, okay. We feel the pain of a lifetime lost in a thousand days through the fire and the flames we carry. Do 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 I hope I hope that that counts. I this is quite a song. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, a compact. I don't really. I like. I play guitar, but in like a, a, a like I I know some chords sort of sense, <laughs> not in like a no. I know how to play guitar sort of sense. Um, so yeah, that was uh through the fire and flames. Um. Thank you all for joining me for Guitar Hero 3, Legends of Rock. My favorite version of Guitar Hero, I would I would love to play it again. I'm sad I no longer have it. My sister got it. Oh wait, maybe we still do have it. <gasps> well on a metal kick. Oh my God. Fear of the Dark Iron Meeting. Okay, so the thing is, Damon, I don't know this song. So I'm gonna just be guessing it. <gasps> all right, 15 clams. I'm all set. 1,000 clams. Keesh, thank you for Respect. the bits. Thank you. Self-taught, sorry, good. Same, same. The, you know, we got to teach ourselves some things. Okay, so I can try. 
D minor B. Let's see if I transpose this. What if it becomes even easier? <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> I am such a cheater at music. <laughs> okay. You have a full rock band set up for 360? <gasps> Hell yeah, that's so fun. D, A, G, E. Sometimes F. I feel the same way about F. Sometimes with F I cheat and I like don't bar it and I just do the this. <laughs> I'm like, yes, this is enough. This is an F chord. <laughs> I own his rock band three and the Beatles are all fun though. I never played a lot of rock band because I, I only had one version of Guitar Hero. Um, okay, let me see if I can like make up what I think this song might sound like for David. <laughs> if that's okay, David, if you want me to play a song I know better, I'd be happy to. Let me hear the... I am a man who walks alone And when I'm walking a dark road At night of strolling through the park When the lights begin to change I sometimes feel a little strange A little anxious when it's dark Fear of the dark, fear of the dark I have a constant fear that something's always near Fear of the dark, fear of the dark I have a phobia that something's, oh someone's always there Have you run your fingers down the wall? Have you felt your neck skin crawl when you're searching for the light? Sorry. <laughs> Sometimes when you're scared to take a look at the corner of the room, you sense that something's watching you. Fear of the dark, fear of the dark I have a constant fear that something's always near Fear of the dark, fear of the dark I have a phobia that someone's always there Oh, it goes on quite a bit longer than that. I hope that that was enough, David. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> that was my interpretation of Fear of the Dark by Iron Maiden. All right. <laughs> Thank you for the clams. bits for <laughs> mm. Um, I always feel kind of silly if I have to guess. Sounds nothing like it. Oh, good. <laughs> it's very much my own version. It's a cover, you know. I'm, uh, I'm rewriting the the metal <laughs> yeah yeah thank you all for the karaoke requests Here, we'll put this to rest the guitar is no more okay should we try and beat a nancy drew tonight maybe we can <gasps> chloe busy robot thank you Thank you for complimenting this shirt. I hope it all goes well. Best of luck with getting everything done today. I know that you're very busy and I'm very excited about your new emote. Oh my God. And everybody follow Snuggly because me and her are going to do a co-stream on Friday. Ba -ba 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 -ba. <laughs> all of the things. <laughs> I hope you're doing well, Chloe. Okay, let's, uh, let's Nancy. Or should we? What if I just go? <laughs> I'm in such a weird mood today now. Now I'm feeling all weird and self-conscious. Why do brains do this, you know? Where they're like, let's make you anxious. It's kind of kind of rude, honestly. Um, 
Yeah, let's try Nancy. We'll try it. We'll see how I do. We'll give it a we'll give it a woohoo. <laughs> Uh, what is this game? What am I playing? Curse of Blackmore Manor. You ever curse a manor? A Blackmore Manor? Or we could play Monster Quest. Uh, which is appearing on my screen. But is not what we will play. But is an option in our hearts. And I did not sign in to Steam. Because why would I ever do that? Why would I use Steam? Steam is stinky. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I lost the chat box. Nancy time. Curse an entire manor. <laughs> wing or two. Yeah. Uh, uh, curse of the left manor. <laughs> or the left wing of the manor. <laughs> what is happening with my... I am struggling to move my Twitch box to the off... Twitch box. My act... What? My chat box. Here we go. Okay. Let's pause this, and we're gonna open this, and then we're gonna open this, and then I'm gonna press this. <gasps> Bernie, brush your teeth! I would brush my teeth with you, but I don't need to yet. But as someone who has to get multiple fillings, let me be a reminder to you all to take care of your teeth, use your fluoride rinse, <laughs> what a struggle. Yeah, streaming is so hard. I'm quitting. Ooh, the bottom of the G Fuel is really gross. I love the shaker, though. It's so cute. <gasps> I have a sticker to put on this. Auntie Mabel has died. Who's Auntie Mabel? Who's Auntie Mabel? Wait, who is... What? What? From Come Outside. I don't know if I know who this is. Aww. Oh, it's UK show. Okay, I don't know it. Oh, that's so sad. Hmm. I like this photo of her. She's got her with a dog. Oh, that's sad. Very kind, loving way. I don't remember how I kill birds here. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Um. Let's recap what has happened. Something must happen when you push the finger so that contraption in the gargoyle passageway in just the right combination. It looks like there are triangles on both sides of the partition, so I need to do the triangle puzzle and need to do the finger puzzle. I am put in mind of Jockey Wilson, Scottish darts player who lost all his by 28 as he ate sweets constantly and refused to brush his teeth as his grand told him the English poison the water. Oh my god. Ah! I would not want to lose all my teeth by 28. That would be miserable. Even though I was thinking about like whether it would be more expensive to keep repairing the teeth I have now or remove them all and get dentures. Like what if I just didn't have teeth? I just got dentures. Like what would be more expensive? Mr. Noun there lost all of his teeth by 28. <laughs> I got got there eventually. Figured it out eventually. <laughs> lost. He lost everything by the time he was 28 because he spent all of his money on sweets. That's what you get when you let your heart win and you spend all your money on sweets. If y'all had a million dollars and were to like accidentally use it irresponsibly, what do you feel like you would like irresponsibly buy mine would definitely be like video games or dolls i feel like i could irresponsibly buy a lot of dolls <laughs> whoops spent my fortune on art dolls okay is it this one so oh god irresponsibility probably put it on red <laughs> oh you gamble <gasps> I could see myself gambling. 
There's a reason I don't go to casinos, because I feel like I, I could uh, become a gambler. Okay, so uh, the puzzle involved four triangles. But what am I supposed to do? Like, what order are they supposed to go in is the question. And I felt like it would be in here. Random cards, board games at 2 a.m. Oh. What's your favorite board game, Mariah? I love board games. Up, up, down. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture of this one because it has four triangles on it. And the other one that has four triangles on it. And I'm gonna see what I can make happen. Maybe there's another like hint that I've missed at the triangle puzzle station. Ye old triangle puzzle station. Okay, it was uh da, 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 da. Oh, I've forgotten how this works. Uh is it still did Nancy write it down? Nancy's really smart and writes a lot of stuff down. Okay, two turns to the left, one turn to the right, one turn to the left, two turns to the right, and one turn to the left. So it's one, two, one, 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 two, one. Yes. Gamer did it. This thing. Only the blameless shall pass oh, here. Oh, I didn't All read this before. All others shall transform Oops. into beasts. Tooth and nail shall grow long, and hair shall turn coarse, till their aspect be as loathsome as their cold hearts. My aspect Prove be thy as worthiness loathsome and as memorialize my here the innocent ones so wrongly <laughs> condemned for saving lives. Else consider thyself right and truly cursed. Okay, so this is the curse that she read. Now I see, I didn't read that before. Oh, wait, I did this. Didn't I already? Do I have to do it again? Maybe I do. Oh no. Oh, I still have I still have the solution. There's one game I have my eye on. It's Monopoly, but all the places and tokens are Texas themed. Oh, that's so fun. I like I like a themed Monopoly. I myself haven't played Monopoly in a very long time though, because I feel like it's uh it's very easy to fight with people. <laughs> So excuse me, I'm like hiccuping. Um, line this one and then the R. Yeah? No? Did I do it wrong? What? Oh, I did. I missed one. <laughs> Welcome into Mary struggles with the puzzles she already solved. Stream. It's the funnest time of the year. Okay. Oh wait, this wasn't the way I needed to go, was it? Wait. What? Oh, was there not a door at the end? Monopoly on the Switch is fun. Ooh. Wait, I opened, okay. I think I already opened that door. I think I unlocked it again for no reason. This is the finger thing. Am I just supposed to click on the ones that make sound? Huh? The statue, it's, it's moving. Oh, sweet, okay. Good. He deserves it. <laughs> he deserves it. I haven't... Oh, I have played the Monopoly on the Switch. Oh my god, when I got sick, I played a ton of Monopoly on the Switch. 
yeah, it's a, it's a pretty good game, except we played it in Spanish for some reason. Neither me nor the person I was playing it with could speak Spanish, but we played it in Spanish, um, and it made it really challenging. Oh! I don't know what just happened. <laughs> oh, there's six on each side. I have no clue what the solution to this is. Okay, go. I uh, check my phone. Thankfully, I get cell service from the middle of nowhere castle. Uh, let's just call Ned, Mrs. Petrov. <laughs> And then maybe Ned. <laughs> I think I need a hint. I guess I could ask Hello? the bird. Hi, Mrs. Petrov. Hi, I could ask what's the going bird, on? But I am here. Goodbye, already. Mrs. Petrov. Thanks, Nancy. You're welcome. I don't want to talk to Ned. Let's talk to the bird. I bet she has hints. Because if I call Ned, I'm going to have to fill him in on everything, I feel like. Oh, well, maybe I can just ask for a hint. Let's see. He's gonna be like, what have you been doing? And I'll be like, you know, just in, a, in England, having the time of my life, solving crime and Hello? solving Hi, Ned. crime. Hey, uh, what's, what's going, going on? on? I should say that so far your call is the high point of my day. So how's Aww. Blackmore Manor? A little on the spooky side. How's Mrs. Petrov's daughter? A little, a on, little the on the spooky side. side. I remember that voice line it's very just clearly. Very strange. She stays in bed hiding behind this curtain all day. Do you have any idea what the deal is? <sighs> she thinks she's been cursed. That feel cursed? win. What do you mean? She saw this Game. ancient curse in a secret How did things go? Way, You're so mad. She it's coming true. Why are we mad? Yikes. That's do I need nuts. to get mad? What happened? Why are we mad? <laughs> also, I gave. <laughs> She doesn't I think just, so. So what the curse say? This. She refused to tell me. Sounds to um, me like you'd better give finding that out your top priority. I do have to I fill him Linda in on everything. Okay, we'll just beast go through all the talking. The beast of Blackmore? In the 17th century, Eleanor Pendleton was rumored to have turned her husband into some kind that of creature for discovering you something that he shouldn't have. your husband have. She was later into a monster. For witchcraft. Anyway. While I was looking into her room through this peephole, I... You were spying on her through a peephole? No. Well, sort of. Okay, so maybe I was. But the point is, I got a glimpse of her hand, and it was all hairy. Gabe, no! Me. Frankly, it was pretty shocking. And That's if the rest terrible! Of her is anything I'm like so her sorry! Hand, well, it's no wonder she won't let anyone see her. Ah! A perfectly logical ah! I have no I am idea sorry. Be, I'm sure there is one. That sucks. People make very Linda's shitty decisions. Linda's stepdaughter, Jane, she has this really weird picture book in her room. What do you mean? I'm sorry you have to book. deal with them. I mean, pictures are all that's in this book. I also... No words, just these yeah. strange hand-drawn images. <laughs> I don't want to say hey, Ben, book but... the old, <laughs> like it's been around for centuries. <laughs> my cards are right. No! I hate it when my cards are right. <laughs> Could be. When I asked her about it, Jane said her grandfather Aww. gave it to her. And but then, hopefully, hopefully that what? means and next then time. And she changed the subject. Everything works out. Mary, that's a lot of people in a field. What did you do? What are you talking about? It's a normal amount of people that I would put in the field. Hello, Rain. How are you doing? Did I not send you a photo of this? My perfect perfection thrift shop find. I put 4,000 people in the field. I put 4,000 people in the field. That's all. <laughs> also, Ned didn't soon. give me a Why hint, and I'm really forward. pissed about it. I just talked to him for nothing. Yeah, I found it while you're shopping. It's one of a few things I got. The other stuff I got is a super secret that will be possibly revealed. Um this Friday when I stream. <laughs> Making dinner, oh, have a good dinner. Have a good dinner, Gabe. Also, Rain, how has your day been? Um, I wanna go thrifting more now. I wanna find more strange shirts. 
Secret. Uh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Also, Rain and anybody else watching this Friday, I'm gonna be doing a co-stream with uh, Snuggly. So we will be. Both of us will be on the stream, but it will be on her channel, hosted there. So. Be there. Be square. Hello. Bye. I babe. still can't get a hint from anybody. Who am I supposed to talk to right now? Wait. You're gonna need a bigger boat. Linda? My werewolf? Yuck. Did you order this meat? I told you, I get hungry. Now go away. Oh, she she likes her, her meat. Oh, God. <laughs> Been good. Work was fine. KB had a good first day. Oh, hell yeah. It's snow. Yeah, the snow is insane. Working on a spreadsheet to track which Pokemon I've got. I love it. Oh my god. So good. Just hang out with the bird until the cell phones. I'm gonna hang out with the bird. Just like scrunched over in the hallway, glaring at anyone who comes close to you. Um, huh. At least, you know, she's coordinating her phone with the meat. Linda? How are you doing? I've been hearing things. Music. Very faint. Very brief. Out of nowhere, going nowhere. Like bells in a faraway church. Wait, I think I think Have that you was ever heard me. them before? No. Well, I heard them too, so don't worry. You're not hearing things. Probably smells great. Yeah. Just plate of raw meat sitting in a room. Ugh. You know, no matter how incredible or frightening things may appear. There's almost always a logical, sometimes even simple, explanation. You don't know everything, Nancy Drew. And in my case, you don't know anything at all. I want you to go home. It's for your own good. She's so If mean. you agree to open Show this me curtain and let me Show see you, me. I'll agree to go home. You're hardly in a position to bargain. I'll just call my mother and tell her I don't want you here, and that'll be that. In the meantime, please leave my room and don't bother to come back. There's no mystery here. Just fate. I have nothing more to say to you. Nothing. Okay, so Linda, I'm Linda? guessing we're reaching end game. Now. There's nothing else I can say to Linda. She's got her meat. Linda's a werewolf, 100%. Like she's just she's lycanthroped her way through life. And oops, <laughs> she closed the door again. So Linda's a werewolf confirmed. Let's talk to Jane. We'll just, yeah, we'll do our final little chats with everyone. And then I think I just Hi, need to like Nancy. solve I get the going. puzzles. Come back soon. I don't even know what I'm like missing still at this point. Like it, it feels like I have five different puzzles that I need to do. <gasps> the man, give, give me that. Give me that. Oh, oh. You looking? <laughs> child scares me. Yeah, that child has a voice actor that's seventy years old. Also. <laughs> okay, Nigel bounced. We scared him out of here. I don't know if I need to look at anything on his computer, but like, at least I know he's gone. Um. <laughs> No, yeah! Her voice actor is 70! Or was 70 when she recorded those lines, I think, at least. I run down these stairs. I know that there's supposed to be a way I can turn the fountain on. I've not figured that out yet. Yes. Um. Goodbye. The pleasure is all mine, child. Okay, she's just gonna say no if I ask for a flashlight. I guess I can call more people. Should I tell, like, the lady her daughter is eating raw meat? Hello, Mrs. Petrov. Unfortunate news about your child. She's a werewolf. Hello. Hi, Mrs. Petrov. Oh. Hi, what's going on? Here we go. I'm afraid Linda has stopped talking. talking to me. What do you mean? She pretty much told me to get lost. Oh, dear. Hello, Hazel. Well, may want you to leave, what a coincidence. Welcome in. Thank you. I found this very cool shirt with a very cool person. How are you doing? Okay, Goodbye, Mrs. Petra. so she's Thanks, not Nancy. kicking us out, even though her daughter threatened to kick us out. That's great. Um, Let's talk to the werewolf lady. 
I just don't know what to do. Can you hold on for a minute? Oh. Get back! Bella, can you get them back in his cage? No, the wolf bane isn't working either. I'm sorry, uh, one of my patients has escaped. Can you call me back later? Thanks. So I can't call her either. The game is like, finish the game. You can finish the game. And I'm like, no, <laughs> really, I can't. Okay, I have butter. I have a couple of pieces. Don't know what this crank is for anymore. Don't know what that key is. Maybe I know what that key's for. I don't know if I know what that key's for. A list of movies? Ooh, have There's a website for that, right? I can't check that off yet. Something happens when you push the fingers. Oh, the contraption. Okay, wait, but I... Okay, so I need to keep messing with the fingers, I guess. Until the right thing happens. Oops. So left, left, right, bit, 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 bit. <laughs> uh oh. <sighs> Looks like it's time for another glow stick. Okay, time to go play games with the child. Letterbox, yeah. I've tried to go through and do that as well. Um, but I find I like forget most movies. I think I have to like see the image of a movie Hi, or something Nancy. to remember if I've Could seen it. Could I get it? another glow stick? Yes, but you know the rule. First, we have to play another game. On your mark, get okay. set, go! Petroglyph punch hours. Thankfully, I'm a petroglyph pro <laughs> at this point. Um, oh my god. Why is this challenging for me? Okay, sometimes you just gotta refresh it, and that actually makes it so much easier. Bird! <gasps> like puffins! Miserable person. Why can't I get three miserable people in a row? I deserve it. I deserve it! What do y'all think the most rare movie you've ever seen is? Like... Few other people have seen it. Elusive entertainment. I'm trying to think of what mine would be. I guess I don't watch too many small films, like indie films. I guess if YouTube counts, then I've seen a lot. Would we count YouTube as being film? What if we only counted film as things that were recorded on film? I have never recorded anything on film. No, I have! I've recorded a Let's Play of Nancy Drew Curse of Blackmore Manor on film. I am a director. <laughs> um, okay, I got a minute. I got a minute. We're doing fine. I don't need to freak out. Brain can stay calm. Wow, maybe I should submit that to Sundance. And that can be my, like, directorial debut. Probably one of the shark movies I've seen. Oh, true. One, like, the cheeky, You're so silly. You're very good. Ta-da! Ooh. Cheeky little Sharknado vibes. You know, you can't run in a campsite. You can only run because it's past tense. Oh, you can't run. You can only ran because it's past tense. That's going. hilarious. Alex, <laughs> I love it. Does it have to be criteria such as being available on streaming? I feel like... I feel like it would have to be neither, right? Ta-da! Ta-da! I beat it. Um, I feel like... Stoker is a movie I've seen that not a lot of people have seen it. I don't know if it's on streaming services either. It wasn't the last time I checked. But maybe it, maybe it is. I feel like it would have to be rarer than that, though. Because that, like, that still was, like, released on Blu-ray, you know? Okay. qualify a home movie um no home movies count okay so it seems like that just moves him around that maybe doesn't do anything what do these do
do I want them not to make the sound? Or do I want it to make the sound? Is this what I should do? And then... Press those? Maybe. I don't know. Let's find out. That was something. Is that just supposed to be a thing I just figure out on my own? <laughs> Am I supposed to know what's happening? <laughs> where I should be looking for a solution for that. I might have to go go look at a little lock through maybe. <gasps> Wait, I did it! Hell yeah. Gamers, what is what do I need it for though? Oh. Okay, so I solved it. But <laughs> <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> That's done. So now the only thing I have left is the triangles I on both sides of the partition. I know how to access the other side, just not the other side of the door. He's looking kind of sus though. Nice abs. Okay, so I have a wand? What am I doing? We're gonna look at this book again. So I know that there are 12 total triangles that I need to move in a pattern. We have four there, four there. One, two, three, four. Oh, could that be it? Wait. One, two, three, four. But like, what order would they go? Across? Can that work? I feel like there's more to this puzzle than what I am assuming, but I'm just gonna take pictures of all these pages and then stand in front of the puzzle until I figure it out. You know, the best way to learn to do something is to just stare at it until it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I did it right. Okay. I don't like the sounds this place makes. Oh, like gas. It sounds like a gas leak is happening. Maybe that's the solution as Nancy is like experiencing. Uh, everybody just has inhaled gas. Okay. Oh, so I can only turn it up or down? Wait, did they start all one direction? Wait, these all show up. Do I also do I want them all to be facing up then? Is that just the entire thing? Okay, it's all up on this side. <gasps> Page one games! My raid alert isn't happening, but hello, friends, welcome in. Oh, it feels so weirdly silent. <laughs> hello. How is your stream? How is it going here? I'm going to quickly switch over so I can give you a lovely little shout out. How is your stream? Welcome in, friends. It's going to play the audio from a clip. It might sound weird. You're playing Ori in the Blind Forest. How are you liking it? I'm trying to figure out what the clip is of. I'm trying to guess what game you were playing. I need to figure out what's happening with that audio thing. But yeah, alerts are just, um, you know, one day we'll have them again. How was your stream though? I hope you're all doing well. Hello everyone, my name is Mary. I'm a variety streamer. Hello, Phasma. Oh, that was from Phasmophobia. Oh my God, that makes sense. Uh, I am currently playing through Nancy Drew Curse of Blackmore Manor. We're at some tricky puzzles uh, and there are werewolves, specifically one werewolf, we believe. She's got real hairy arm and is eating raw meat. And so we're trying to solve puzzles 
And uh, yeah, that's kind of it. Welcome in everybody. Welcome Paige and hello and Satanist. Is that your username? That's so clever. What was your birthday game? Oh my god, so fun. The stream is great. It made good progress. Ki kind of a boss. Oh, that's so fun. It's going good here. We're, we're kind of nearing the end of the game. Um, So like the puzzles we have left are really like thick puzzles. It's a, it's, a, it's a bit of a challenging puzzle, but I really like the plot of the game. So that's, that's going good. But welcome in it, Paige. If you need to hop off and like take care of yourself, get some water, get some food, chill after stream. I totally understand. But thank you so much for the raid and sharing your community here with me. Hello, friends. Welcome to the space. <laughs> yeah, that's so good. Hello. You're able to identify it. You got ears of steel. Um, so I'm doing this puzzle right now where I put these ones up and I think I have to go through through a different secret passageway to get the other side all facing up. We will see. This is my mom now. Hello, Cass. Oh, is it Cassius? Cassius Weck? Hello, welcome in. Did not recognize it at all. Oh, the audio, yes. <laughs> oh! There goes the alerts! <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome in. <laughs> Need to go make food. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Go chow. Enjoy some dinner. Uh, everybody come hang out in silence with me in the cave. <laughs> uh, oh, my God. Glow stick lit secret passageways. You can tell my brain is starting to fry because I had my G Fuel at, like, I don't know three hours ago. A beautiful know, delayed know. alert. Oh, and you all can meet the parrot. We have Lulu the parrot. A main character. A star of the show. We can poison her. Bye, bird. <laughs> Kill her. And then we get kicked out. The excitement. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture of this because actually this thing is a little, a little solution. Um... If any of you haven't played any of the Nancy Drew games before, I highly recommend them. They're very fun puzzle point and click adventures. They have really good ambiance. Like you gotta you gotta explore different things. We can, you say. We have. <laughs> I unfortunately have already murdered Lulu. <laughs> you know, just a little casual group maybe. Okay, so we are in secret passageway. This is technically passageway number one, um, but our cell phone still works underground. Or I assume this is underground, but it's probably not actually. It's just like a outside section of the um, area. Okay, so this needs to go up. And this needs to go up. Oh, I finally opened it! That was so much simpler than I thought it would be. Wow, I was really making things complicated for myself. I love it when games just let me, like, struggle wow, for a looks while. looks like I won't be needing any more of Jane's glow sticks. <gasps> oh my god, I don't have to play games anymore? And this is a big puzzle, so I'm gonna save <laughs> really quick just in case. Uh, I'll call it Mary Really Likes Puzzles. Liked puzzles. <laughs> this is how. Th oh, hello, Delta. You testing? You did you think I broke my little alert things? Okay, do I have a solution to this in a photo? I feel like this could be something I have a photo of already. Maybe. Oh, hello, Keish. <laughs> No, wait, why is it a no? What is what is the no for? Oh my gosh, the room is moving. Oh my god, wait, that's how this works. Okay, so I could go back. Oh wait, I want to go to the moon one. I want to go to the moon one. Nope, 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 nope. What? I wanted to go through the moon. Wait. What? Did I get exactly where I wanted to be on accident? No. Okay, so, God, the rooms rotate. I want to go to triangle. This, I was trying to do a different thing to do this, I feel like. I'm in the center. I wanna go 
put a triangle. If I go through this door, that's a wall. The rooms rotate again. Oh, do I have the thing that I, oh. Oh wait, it's, it's perfectly set up. So I need to go, what one do I need to go through though? What one is that? I have three, I have four options. Can I, oh, it moved again? Wait. Where am I? This is where I wanna be. So I can do this and back out. And do it again. Back out. And then if I turn around, we should be back in the middle of things I fucked up. Do I want to get in that room when it's at the devil thing? That's a wall. Okay, wait. Maybe... No. This is a little hard. Okay, so that's the room I want to go in. But now I'm in the outside rotating room. Okay but I don't want to go in there. But it didn't rotate. Okay, so I think I just need to do this. Okay, need to turn around. Look at this room. Oh, why did I put my flashlight away? Okay. So. I was here. I turned around, look forward. It was the wall. I turned around to back away, which means I should go straight and that will be the exit. Yes. Oh my God. Why are there two ways I can go? Wait, this is the stairs again. Did I take myself in a st I was supposed to go the angel way. Damn it. What? Really? Ah. Ah. I just went in a circle. Okay. Okay, so hypothetically and then and then I'm at the angel which is where I should go maybe oh what am I supposed to do here what do they want do I what? Weird symbols. Maybe knowing what that snake symbol means will help me figure out what the others mean. Oh, so I have to... Can I call people from here? Can I... Can I Google? <laughs> no? Ned! Help me! <laughs> Hi, me again. Hi, what's up? You sure I'm not disturbing you? I mean, shouldn't you be studying or something? Why can't... Shouldn't you be solving a mystery or something? I'm on a break. What a coincidence. So am I. What's up? I'll talk to you soon. Just be careful over there. Do I need to talk to someone then? I... Oh, I don't want to. I really don't want to. 
I don't want to go back. I don't want to figure this out. What a Chad doesn't even talk to his girlfriend. Do the spinny rooms. I shouldn't have done the spinny room, but now I am do somewhere. Where am I? <laughs> what room am I in? <laughs> Getting lost. Okay. Where? What's happening? I want to go to the triangle. Is this that way? No. Is this that way? Maybe. Let's find out. Nope. Oh. Talking to other girls. <laughs> the boys are watching Mary Loves Me on Twitch. Uh, I'm hungry. I feel like I'm gonna be too grumpy for this. No! This grumpy little Mary at her computer. Ooh. I should get a snack. I should retire from all games immediately. I don't even think I have a snack I could eat. I just made this so simple for myself. I was able to do this. And it wasn't a big deal. I can play games, you know. I <laughs> feel that. Thank you, Quiche. I'm not alone. We're all in this together. You bought an expensive computer to play games with? Uh, yeah. This is a Windows 98 game account. <laughs> I literally crashed my computer today installing a game from 2008 on it. <laughs> so, you know, I'm a gamer, right? <laughs> Wait, that was where I wanted to be. I was exactly where I wanted to be. Silly Mary. I want cookie dough really badly. That sounds very good right now. Uh, straight. And don't go in. And straight. Wait, I wanted to. Oh, what? Oh shit, I did it wrong. It wasn't Freddy Fish, no. It was a game that I don't think anyone would know. Um, it's, it's for a video I'm doing. I'm, try I'm trying out a new video series. Um, it wasn't Pup Putt or Pajama Sam either. Or Raymond, sadly, no. Raymond would be fun to get working, but... Oh, I want to be in here, I think. Or do I? Where am I? Wait, where am I? Oh, I didn't want to be in here. Um... No, it's a secret. It's a secret surprise for YouTube. You will get to see uh, later. I just keep going the wrong way. What? There's nothing in the box. <laughs> you know what? I saved right before I went in here, but then, but then, but then I can't. Oh, but then I didn't do the thing I was supposed to do. Okay. Continue game. My PC box has many games in it. Many games. Many games. I can, let me see if I can give you a hint. Where is the box for it? Where did I put it? Oh, it's on the floor. <laughs> okay. Um, what could be a hint? Without, without spoiling. No one is gonna know what this is. If you know what this is from this, you're not a hu real human. It's a mystery. <laughs> Raymond is scary the way he can disjoint himself. <laughs> he can theoretically throw his butt at you. <laughs> Wait, you got Raymond to work on your computer, Quiche? Find yeah, you gotta find out what happened in the next episode of Mary PC. You gotta follow me on YouTube. <laughs> no, it's, it's a secret. You saw, you saw, and it disappeared. 
Now it's no more. I keep going the wrong way. Wasn't the disc version? Ah, uh, yeah. That that maybe solves it. Discs ruining everything. I feel like this is going in a circle. No, it's not. Okay. Um, now the version works like a charm. I should get it. I should get it. It's not on my YouTube yet. I just filmed the video today. I have to edit it still. I am... I feel this is kind of suffering. I, I had it so easy and then I... <laughs> then I got stuck. Uh, and I'm very much going the wrong way. Okay, I can get in the rotating room. I'm good. Am I in the rotating room? I'm in the rotating room. Okay. Okay. So I need to go out this door. Look at this door. Scott! Hello! Welcome in. Sorry, I didn't even notice you for a second. I've been getting distressed, but it's fucking game! <laughs> that is too hard! <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. I'm out of the rooms, which means I need to figure out, I need to research about the dumb snake. I don't even know who I'm supposed to talk to about it. Wait, Scott, you just went from a blue name to a red name. Did that happen live? Did you live change your name color? Or is that Twitch being silly? This game is, like, increasing my blood pressure, I feel like. And I'm guessing she's still not talking to me. No, and she still hasn't eaten her steak. I'll be going now. Scott... Scott, you can't do this to me. You can't be constantly changing your identity. I won't know how to- I won't know who to trust. I wonder if anybody's done that with, like, creating, like, games based around, like, you can make little teams with name colors, right? Hi, Nancy. Do oh, you hey. happen to know what the symbol of a snake eating its That's own tail means? That's a good green. Means? That's a really good green. Never heard of that. <laughs> identity I should get going. No joke! <laughs> Okay, so she doesn't know what the snake eating its own tail means. Let's go talk to the other people in the house. There aren't haters. He's ah, back. there you are. Oh, he covered I'm the sculpture. I'm sorry to inform you that I shall soon be leaving Blackmoor. I just have a few things to take care of, and then I shall bid He's you adieu. He's going. <laughs> Having a color crisis. You match the stream so well when you're pink. <laughs> Why? Where are you going? I have good reason to believe this place is genuinely haunted. There's oh God. no way I'm staying here one minute longer than I have to. Thankfully, I've finished most of my research and have enough to start my book. Ouroboros! That's what it's called? The snake? Do you oh, know wait, what the symbol know. of a snake eating its tail signifies? The Ouroboros? It's a very old image and is usually associated with alchemy. You really do come what? up with <laughs> the strangest questions, Nancy. <laughs> I'll let you get back to your work. I don't Tally snack. Ho. Tally ho! <gasps> Mew Mew style, Mew Mew grace, Mew Mew power in your face. Ouroboros. Boris, Ouroboros. Um, <laughs> it caused the game to close. <laughs> Thank you for the resub. You broke the game, Boris. Oh, welcome in. <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> FMA, I need to watch FMA. Um, oh my god, okay. <laughs> no more game. <laughs> He's been here since the start of waiting for this moment for the Ouroboros. <laughs> it's okay. That was really weird. I don't know why that happened. I'm having like weird computer stuff with OBS today, so I don't think it's you. I think it's my stinky PC. 
It was amazing timing. Oh, excuse my yawn. I'm going to cruise, Keish. <gasps> where do we do want to go on a cruise to? You gonna go to Alaska? Okay, so there's something with alchemy. What's on my checklist now? Read up on alchemy and figure out the symbol. Can't check that off till it's done. With Ouroboros, Ouroboros. <laughs> okay, I need to go on the web. Discover what the deal is with the symbol. I'm finished with that. Find out what's on the other side of those That's moving done. rooms. See where the passageway leads. Oh That's my god, done. I've done so many things. Literally, the only thing I have to do is go on the internet. <laughs> nice. Alchemy symbols. Okay. I'm not gonna have a breakdown over this. Okay, let me take photos of this. In awe. Awe. What do you think we're gonna have to make? Alchemy spanned thousands of years. Ugh. Thousands? Okay, routinely process and combine substances in order to create new ones. They collected the oily material, what? That forms naturally as sulfur-bearing rocks and distilled it to make green vitriol, iron sulfate, and then distilled green vitriol to make vitriol, sulfuric acid. Do I have to do chemistry? Oh my god, don't tell me I have to know all- Wait, I can read all of this from in the cave. We're fine. Okay, what does Nancy say to do next? I, I haven't- read... Can't check that off till it's done. I haven't done I read that it. yet. I read it, Nancy. Don't worry. I read it. We're ready to go back in. We can- I don't even know what I'm trying to make, though. <gasps> Streamer cruise! Oh my god, we can do a uh, Twitch call on a boat! We took a bunch of streamers and we put them on a boat! That'd be fun. Then it could be like a murder mystery, maybe. But nobody gets murdered. It's like a fake murder mystery. Cause and then it could be like murder on the Orient Express, except it's a boat. There's a there's a version of that. The murder on the Nile, I think, is exactly that, right? And at the end, we're all guilty, because we all did the murder. What room am I in? Okay. <gasps> Took it on a raft. <laughs> So, I need to do this one. And then two. And then uh, three. Oh, no, I needed only to do it twice. No, what? Oh, yeah. Okay. Fuck, I fucked it up. Nobody look at me. I'm having a really hard day with puzzles. I already looked up cruises out of Amsterdam after TwitchCon. Ooh. Oh, wait. Just can't. All right. <gasps> 15, Fifteen clams. clams. I'm, I'm all, all set. set. Kelly, thank you for the meds. Just can't find anyone to go on a cruise with. People care about locations, but I just want to be isolated in the middle of nowhere, disconnected from the world. Unlimited food at the buffet for like a week. That sounds kind of amazing. Kind of perfect. Just get to be on a boat for a bit and not care about anything else. Wait, that was literally where I needed to go. Oh, it didn't move yet. Thank God. Okay. Wait. I went the wrong way. Little hours of Mary struggling is just the vibe of the end of this game. Scott, should we just blind buy an old sloth? <laughs> Go sailing pirating, yes! Yes, my dad went sailing in his youth to Hawaii. I feel like that's such an adventure to go on. Okay. So I need to make this. I need to make this. Sounds nice until you're on a cruise that couldn't dock anywhere after COVID. Oh my God, so true. In like a post COVID world, right? <laughs> I, uh, in the future. It does if you pirate from a cruise ship. Oh, it doesn't have unlimited Okay. You just gotta hop on a cruise ship, steal their food. <laughs> hop off. So you make VF, which is Aqua Fortis. Which I'm guessing would be water. None of these are water. Oh, 
I'm, I might, I might, I might just, I might look up a little walkthrough. I, you gotta combine. I gotta. Oops. Sometimes just press too many buttons, I guess. <laughs> and Nancy just died. <laughs> I just had COVID and today was the first day I successfully tested negative and don't have a fever. So I'm like ready to be out there. That's reasonable. <sighs> oh my God. Aquafortis means strong water. It's nitric acid. Okay. Thank you, Damon. Um, <laughs> how do I make nitric acid? I know it. Oh, I can, it can read the thing still. I can read the thing still. Okay. I have the resources still. I don't have to look up a tutorial yet. We want to make aqua fortis. Okay. They would then combine vitriol and nitrate to make aqua fortis. So I have to do all of, all of this. So... <laughs> I need to combine iron and sulfate. Call me back when she beats this. <laughs> no, Scott. Hello, Siren. Welcome in. I'm exploding. So I need to combine sulfur bearing rocks. Make green vitriol. Where is green vitriol on this list? If it is, it might not be. Nitrate. Oh, so I need vitriol and nitrate. So I need this and this. I solved it. Okay, so now I need to make VR, which is Aqua Regina. Aqua Regina. Virginia Simpson. Okay. Aqua Madrina. Okay. They would also distill green vitriol and make common salt to make spirit of salt. Which is that one. Okay. Spirit of salt combined with one part aqua fortress, it would create aqua regina. So do I have to just add this? No? Uh oh. Am I gonna die again? So is this and this makes and then this? This? This combined with this? No? Maybe I didn't read that right. Nancy's making up. <laughs> yeah, we're doing alchemy. I'm attempting alchemy. I'm definitely struggling a little bit with how I'm supposed to do this. Okay. Also, make spirit of salt, which... Did I read it wrong? No, okay. It is the weird circle with a plus. When three parts were combined with one part, it would create that. Does that mean I need one, two, three? Or this, this, one, two, three. Okay. Okay. That looks like mercury. Is it... Mercury? I don't know why I think that that's mercury. I'm not seeing it on my list. This goes against all calculations I know. Maybe, is it copper? 
will the will the website just randomly know what I'm doing? Yeah, any chemistry teachers here? Literally my least favorite subject in school. There's not a single class I think I struggled in as much. Okay. Oh my god, look at all of this. Okay, so I now have Aqua Regina. So then lime could be created. It, does it, is lime what it wants me to make? Sounds fun. Any progress in this? Yes, so our friend that we're visiting is definitely like a werewolf. But her house has multiple secret passageways in it that we've gone through. This puzzle is part of one of the secret passageways. And her stepdaughter is like kind of in a like cult thing? Question mark? Exclamation point? Definitely, it's so hard. Chemistry is part of forensic science. It is bad. Yeah, chemistry is really hard, in my opinion. Um, I've always been bad at it. Sorry, I'm trying to still read. Maybe it is. Maybe I need to make lime by burning chalk or limestone, while mercury was obtained by burning cinnabar. A sun is called liquor apius, the symbol for which matches the zodiac sign for Capricorn. Okay, it was created by distilling sulfur, lime, and sal almanac. Okay, so I need cinnabar. Question mark? Which is the one that looks like two threes. I need cinnabar. I need chalk or limestone. Which one of these is chalk or limestone, baby? Give me the T. Or lime. Lime chalk or limestone. I have quick lime. Maybe it's quick lime. Quick lime. Oh, okay, that is. That is. Okay. So I need. The one that's a U with a line in it, and the three, three, those will combine. And then I need Sol Almanac, which is that one. Okay, oh my god, can I do this? I don't know if the parts mattered. Oh, the parts. <laughs> chemistry and horses these games they are made to be educational i know some people like got to play them in school like their library would have a computer that you could play these on and i'm sure if i actually read i would learn so much more <laughs> by burning chalk or limestone while mercury is obtained by burning cinnabar a substance called lycorhepsis I'm supposed to be isolating the essence of the soul right now? That's a big ask. <laughs> how many, how many parts, how am I supposed to do this? Lime, soul, almanac, and soul. Oh, wait, 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 I'm doing things wrong maybe. Sulfur, lime. I need sulfur, not mercury. I'm being silly. Sulfur lime. Which one is sulfur? Maybe I'm not being silly. I kind of think this game is silly. Oh, okay. So sulfur is the triangle. Lime is... The U. Triangle, U, and then Sol Almanac is that thing. Which I realize you all can't see. Okay, I'm gonna have to look this up. I do not know. I do not know. Curse of Black Momana? <laughs> Alchemy? Sulfur lime. I'm not, I, I have... 
I think I have. There's another. Oh my god, there's more puzzles. <laughs> so many more fucking puzzles in this game. <laughs> um. We're not actually making a bomb. We're trying to get in through a door. Which, hypothetically, if we need to, like, <laughs> make a bomb to do that, then we gotta make a bomb to do that, right? Um... <laughs> do some fork at the time, because we forgot a part. Yeah, walkthroughs are so helpful. Okay. Oh my god. So, somebody did this in a very different order than I did. Why, why do people play these things in the way that I do? Third mixture is mercury. Click on cinnabar and fire symbol. Then on the pot, okay. Cinnabar, fire. <laughs> what was fire? Okay, fire, cinnabar? Okay, okay. Fourth one is distilled vinegar. Click on vinegar and distillation. Yeah, bomb the door, absolutely. I think that is actually the way that we deal with this. Vinegar, distillation. Wow, I really figured that out. Last mixture is liquid hapis. Click on sulfur, quicklime, salt almanac, and distillation. I would not have got this on my own, I think. Like, maybe. I don't feel like it's giving me any hints at this point. Sulfur? Quick lime? Cell almanac? I don't think I'm pronouncing that right. And then distillation, which is... Less. It's weird not to have a ring on my finger anymore. Oh, goodness. That would be quite strange to go from being used to just wearing something every day. Oh, I'm sorry, Siren. Hmm, you are one big drink of water, aren't you? What a man. What a man. Huh. He doesn't have feet. He's got wheels. Rolling around at the f speed of sound, as they say. Ooh, a little puzzle? Whoa. Sounds like the big guy out there just took a step. Looks like some winds are stronger than others. <laughs> oh, he got blown in the hole! Nancy's flirting with the statue. <laughs> yeah, it gets easier every day. Baby steps, right? Gotta just kind of take it as it comes. No. I just immediately died? Am I supposed to? I don't know where he's supposed to go. But maybe there? Nope, it reset. Okay. So apparently there's somewhere very specific he's supposed to go. Yeah, baby steps is kind of all, all you can do sometimes. And that's the best way to go about it. Okay, I begin to take note of my activities, reporting to the constable that they have heard strange noises and been seen strange lights while passing the manor at night. I am loath to cur tell my experiments. Oh, oh, so the weird sounds and things are just him being a, a little scientist. It's not a beast, it's science. 
Baby steps to not developing a retail therapy. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> yeah. Not coping with shopping is always a good choice. I like cursive. It's so hard to read. Hereby decree the initiate may be male or female, and that the education of said initiate is to begin no sooner than the 12th. Oh. Am I supposed to read all this? Probably. Okay, lots of words. Oh, there's so much. Unlocks the key. But I. Oh, I could get in here. Oh, I solved this without. <laughs> door chimes for secret doors. Oh. Wait, is there more to that than I thought? If you think about it, in history, what would you know as science was considered witchcraft at one point? Very true. Very true. There's just a sword there. A lot of stuff happening on the roof. This does not this seem like, like a safe some place kind for of medieval me. forge. Looks like a chunk of metal. Hell yeah! Can I can't pull that? Whatever it is. This looks like some kind of ancient. By pulling out different plugs, I can create different patterns in the mold. Okay, so this is to make a key. So I gotta make a key at some point. The master of the winds. Uh, that's a lot of words right there. Blackmore Manor has remained largely intact all these years. My dear initiate. Oh. Oh, she's not gonna read it. Nancy, just read. Congratulations for progressing this far. Your goal may not be in sight, but it is very, very close. I have- oh, I leave this for you because the- something can be daunting and not a little discouraging. Just bear in mind that to use it you must first light it, and to light it you must give it four things. Each in liquid- oh, earth in liquid form, air, water, and fire. Should you require more information, consult the thing. Something even my grandfather- did with some frequency. Penelope Penvalin. Penelope Penvalin is very pretty er, calligraphy. I'm sad I can't read it better. <laughs> I regard that we shall never, oh, regret that we shall never meet, but you will get a glimpse into my life when you encounter my contribution to the security of our treasure. Oh, yeah, okay. Likewise, were I somehow able to project myself onto into the future, I would learn something about you were I to come across the obstacle which you will have created. Oh, so like generations have made different puzzles to stop people from coming. Blackmore Manor is indeed the sum of the hearts and the minds of all who have dwelt here. Ah. Okay. Albert Pemvelin created, I even found some of his notations and have performed many of its experiments. Okay, it's just giving me little bits of lore about all the different Penvelins. Um, huh. It's a big guy. We can move him around. Got a key, so I need to make a key. Let me look at my checklist again. I need to make a key, figure out what to do. Can't check that off till it's done. Move the big guy around on that grid in the lab until he collects Can't all check four that off. wins. Oh, he has to get the wins. Oh, I'm glad Nancy read. <laughs> glad Nancy can read. Good for her. What a gamer. I just thought I had to run away from them. like if they're auto set to go in one specific direction oh no daughter is super excited about tomorrow she's a field trip <gasps> that's so fun where are they going not specifics of course but like zoo outdoor recreation I 
Is it just random? I got him. He's mine. Okay, collected one wind. He's just gonna keep blowing me back. I guess I can hang out out here. They're going to a space cornet. Ooh, that's cool. Space is cool. Okay, I have two. I just need two more. These ones seem like they're gonna be harder to get because they like staying along the edges. Hello, you to vapes! Welcome in! I am like struggling through the end right now. These final puzzles are quite hard. What's your favorite part about it though? No! Oh, silly. Ah, oh, it's so heartbreaking! It's so rude. So rude. Why does it keep killing me at the start? Couldn't get money in time to go with her, but her grandparents are going, oh, that's so fun. I'm glad. Aha. Uh -huh. What am I doing wrong? Okay, I killed myself that time. The sound effects are so good. This is... The sound design in these games is fantastic. Is so much as I complain about being ruthlessly murdered by wind. There's no, like, universal way to beat this, right? Okay. Okay, I don't know. There's no solution. Sorry you couldn't come with us. Aww! I'm glad, I'm glad you can still, um... going insane! I want popcorn. I deserve popcorn after this. What a silly game. Okay. Got one. I need to just not go in the areas where they can kill me, except right now when I collect this guy. Exactly, Mariah. Exactly. I know eventually he might... Yes! Okay, okay, okay. I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. He's gonna blow me away. Oh, I have to be here, I think. And just... 
Yes. I got him. I got him. It sounds like air is going to the yes. forge. Okay. Ho, 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 ho. We did that. We did that. I'm going to save. I'm going to save because I figured out the air. Mary does not really like puzzles. Big air moment right there. Oh, just love me some big fucking air, you know? You know? Okay. That should be something I can check off. That's yes. done. Everything that I'm I was finished to see with that. The, oh, I found everything. Okay. Check. So I figured out the symbols. So all I need to do now is figure out the prongs. Which, okay, there's still one puzzle I haven't finished. But, like, Nancy hasn't commented on it, so I'm gonna... Uh... Looked at everything here, so I feel like the solution to it isn't here then. I think I need to go upstairs and do a puzzle that I've like missed basically. So that's one, two, and then I think out this door. Yes. Wowza! Okay, we're making progress. The game is happening. I'm getting a headache. No, I think I'm just very hungry. What should I eat for dinner tonight? Mm -hmm. Pasta sounds really good. I like really want macaroni, but I don't have... Ooh, hello? Hi, it's Ned. I've been dying to know how things are going there. What's the latest? Why am I having a Ned call? Well, I've discovered some kind of medieval alchemy lab. I already called lab. Ned. Really? Where? Under the manor. I and I mean Ned. way Ned. under the manor. <laughs> in fact, I may be the only one in this place who knows about it. What's in it? Well, I was hoping to find the fabled pendle and treasure. I like treasure, the moment Nancy's like, I have to fill people in on what's happening. Forge? Isn't the Baked thing you potato. Use metal and make swords and stuff? Right. I have some sweet potatoes. So I can make one. Now? Well, actually, the forge looks like something I saw in that strange picture book Jane has that I told you about before. Oh, she's which means just. I should probably check it out more thoroughly. <sighs> probably hasn't been used for centuries. That's the thing. It looks like it has been used recently. I mean, relatively okay. recently. Okay, so Certainly this call was just so Nancy could tell so. us what to do what next. What would be using a forge to make in this day and age? There was also this big keyhole in the lab. Oh, my speaker what died. What about a key? No key. Well, there you go. Maybe We're gonna make a big old key. The key that goes in that keyhole? Big old key. My guess. Yeah, baked sweet potato sounds very I'll good right now. I'll talk to you soon. You'd better. Bye, Nancy. Baked potato. Okay. So I gotta look at the book in Jane's room, and maybe she'll be like, oh, it means this. And I'll be like, thanks, Nancy. You're so right, Nancy. I'll bet You're this so book can help me figure out how to get that old forge going again. I bet and it can. And maybe even how Nancy. to find the pendulum treasure. I bet it can, which is why I've taken pictures of everything. Been parboiling and frying. Ooh! <gasps> that sounds really good. My big one for science. I have an air fryer, so I, I like air frying my potatoes. Okay. Don't know what any of this means. Don't know what any of this means. Love it. This thing is the solution to the key puzzle. I'm almost positive. So I'm gonna take a picture of that. Oop. The devils are like, touch it with your hands. Touch the fire. Okay, air is catching the winds, which we have done. Um, I don't remember what simple that is. Earth? Cups? Dragon? Wind? I don't remember. Oh, wait. Is this the same as the alchemy symbols? Mama has an air fryer. I really like my air fryer. I use it for a lot of different vegetables. Okay, so this is fire. So fire is we have to fight monsters with mercury. That's, that's that. Air is catching the wind. Is this water? Water is four cups. Cups. And then earth is this. 
Yeah, Jane, Jane just, you know, she's just really into it. No, that was a, a book passed down to her from her uh, family member, or through her family. So the thing I haven't solved yet that I don't know when or how I'm supposed to solve is the water puzzle. Because there's a, there's a fountain in here that's dry, and I must not have looked close. Like, there, there must be something here that I've missed that I can click on. Doesn't work. Yeah, because the water is turned off. Doesn't work. Crinkle cup fry sounds so good. I don't know how to turn the water on. I feel like this was something I was supposed to do a very long time ago. Scott, thank you for the posture check. <laughs> Is this even something that was on my checklist? I don't think it was. Oh, oh I still haven't opened up all the columns. Done. I did that. That's done. So I still need to open up all the pillars. I have a feeling I can't do that till I do this, but I don't know how to. Hmm. Yes. Would you have a torch that I could borrow? I know no, this isn't I'm gonna afraid get me anywhere. Not. Jane ruined all of ours with some sort of experiment she cooked Jane. up. Jane! But I believe she may have some of those glow sticks for illumination. Goodbye. Okay. Run along! I might have to look at the walkthrough again because. Oh! I just missed what I need to see, apparently. Or did I? I ha I've missed a journal. Okay. I have a headache. I don't think I can keep going tonight. I'm hungry. I think I need to go just have a little break. Have a little chill time. Um, thank you all for hanging out, though. I'm sorry, I feel like this hasn't been a super fun stream, but, like, I am, you know, I'm just a little cranky, I think. I think I just need to go get some sleep. Um, and we'll finish this on Wednesday. I'm sorry to put this off for another day. I just need to go, go have a chill time for a little bit, but thank you all for hanging out tonight. Um... Yeah, I just need to go eat some food. I'm I'm literally hang hangry, Delta. That is a great way to put it. I'm I'm hangry. Um, thank you all for hanging out. This is always so fun with all all of you. I need to just start eating dinner right before stream. So on Wednesday, everybody bully me to go eat dinner before I stream, so I don't do this again. I want to have a little sandwich. I feel like a sandwich would be very good. But yeah, thank you all for hanging out. I hope that you all have a fantastic rest of your day. And I will see y'all next time. Bye-bye.